shipwreck that's estimated to be hundreds of years old is now being preserved by University of South Florida scientists, but not in the traditional way. Our Carson Chambers explains. It drew hundreds of people. The shipwreck is centuries old, each plank marked with Roman numerals. Think of it like a giant jigsaw puzzle. You could almost take it apart and use the numbers to put it back together. But as soon as it washed ashore on Ponte Vedra Beach near Jacksonville, the clock started ticking. We can do things very quickly with the type of instruments that we have. USF's Dr. Lori Collins and her team called in by state archaeologists to 3D scan the wooden schooner that may have sunk in the 1800s. Now that it's Exposed to air, the 48-foot wreck could disappear as mysteriously as it was revealed. If something happens to this, if the tide takes it out before something can be done or if someone comes in and loots the site or vandalizes it, we have it digitally preserved. So you're right on the beach. You're right near where they found the, the shipwreck. USF's library isn't just for books anymore. These kinds of things are being archived, preserved, and presented through the library. And so at USF, we have an entire 3D initiative out of the library. Students and researchers can now navigate 3D records of finds like these. We were mapping out exact locations of all of the endpoints with the timbers. And they never have to even set foot on the beach. So we're looking at things like tool marks that are made. In Tampa, I'm Carson Chambers, ABC Action News.